All right, you guys, I'm going to show you how to resort the teams in the game um, with uh, Red MC. Now, with the Pelican or with the Hornets turning into the Pelicans and the Bobcats all but guaranteed to turn it back into the Hornets, I know a lot of people are going to be releasing mods that change the names of these teams. And you might want the teams to actually show up in the proper order in the game. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. So let's load up Red MC. I'm going to try to do this as free as possible. You do need a Teams tab license that you have to buy uh, to edit the Teams tab. So let's just open up a copy I have of my uh, base that I use. Now let's go to the Teams tab. So you remember you need a license to edit this Teams tab. And of course if you do a thing other than the rosters file, you need to have a license to open the other files. So let's go to the Bobcats and let's you know let's go to the Hornets and just change them to Pelicans. So we change into the Pelicans, that's all there is to it. Nice, quick, and easy. But the Pelicans should show up right here in between the Pacers and the Pistons. So to do this, you can press Control and click on the 10 right here next to the Pelicans. Control C to copy. Open up Excel or Open Office and just paste it in on the as close to the first column as you can. Then in the tool again, you can we're going to be moving everyone from the Pistons up. So we're Pacers. So go all the way to the right. Select the end of the Pacers tab. Come back and go up to the Jazz. Copy. Click on the Pelicans. Paste. So that moved all the play, all of the teams up one, and then as, as you see, we have two pacer teams. Go back in here, click on this one here to select the entire row. Control C to copy. Over the second pacers, paste. That's it. Now, when I load up the game, the Pelicans will show up in the correct spot. Uh, just to double down on it and uh, just screw everything up, let's change the Bobcats to the Hornets. Copy this over into. Open Office, and we're going to shift everyone right up to here, the heat. So the heat, go all the way to the end of theirs, come back over, shift click up until the Hornets that you changed, copy, paste, click here, copy, paste. And now we have not only the Pelicans renamed in an alphabetical order, but the Hornets renamed in an alphabetical order. That's it. That's as easy as it is. And since you're copying the entire column, or excuse me, the entire row, all of the uh, rotations shift over as they should, the only part where you're going to run into difficulties are the, teams, uh, the team IDs um, here in uh, the Players tab. Now, I'm going to show you the really quick and easy way to fix this. So let's go ahead and save this uh, roster. And as the team's ID goes off of this ID right here, not the graphics ID. So because of that, players that used to be on the Bobcats will now say that they're on the Bucks, which, you know, that's a little bit of a problem. So let's show you how to fix that real quick. I use the other roster editor by Leftos because he has a really neat little tool here for this. Uh, roster editor. I already had selected. I couldn't find it. All right, let's open up the same roster tw a second time. And as what's fantastic about this is that not only do we have the team ID one, team ID two, we also have assigned to. And you can't edit this one. It goes off the teams tab and shows you what player or what team this player is actually on. And it uses the same ID as the team ID, so you can just copy this over to team ID two and team ID one. So we can go ahead and just select this entire column, not by clicking it, John. <laughs> that wasn't the smart thing to do. <laughs> so as you see here, the team ID says it wants to be one, but really the team, the player's on team nine. That's what we're trying to fix here. So go all the way to the bottom, copy all of that, and we can just, well, we, I think we need to go into open office first and get rid of this assigned to, because I didn't turn dump pasting on. If you turn dump pasting on, you don't need to do that. Select all of the numbers I copied out and paste them right here into team ID. Now the team IDs are updated. 
the players will wear the correct uniforms in the edit player black top and um, have the correct logo behind their head you will have renamed and reordered all of the teams properly and that's it <laughs> so I hope this helps just save it and you're done I, I hope you learned something I hope this helps if you re need additional help with this uh, let me know in the comments and I will see you in the next video. Bye.